Riser. Welcome to the light facility. Now I know the receptionist has already talked through the session with you and I know you have already signed the consent form but I do want to run through it just one more time to make sure you really understand what the session today will entail. Okay, so the lights that we will be using today are mainly not bright and the ones which are bright will not be shone directly at you. They will be shone, um, for example, at my hand, at my face, um, or shone through a piece of paper. Now, we will also be working up to it. Um, we will make sure that you have time to adapt and feel comfortable for your eyes to um, acclimatize. We will not be diving straight into the lights. That being said, they are still lights. So if you feel uncomfortable or unwilling to participate, that is completely fine. Um, please let me know and we will not continue with today's session. Okay, you're happy to continue? Well, if you change your mind at any point, then just let me know, okay? Wonderful. Let's begin. So, the first thing we will do is not a light. It is to help your eyes acclimatize. So, I have two cards like this. And on one side is a reflective circle, and on the other side is a hole. Now, this is to mimic a very gentle light. So, I'm going to ask you, first of all, to just look through the hole, and I would like you to just follow it wherever it goes. Good. We're just beginning with some very simple eye movements and instructions. Keep following, keep looking through the hole. Okay, now let's try looking at the reflective circle, okay? This is a little bit brighter, but you're doing excellently. Okay, now I will bring in the other. So this is just the same. I would like you to continue to follow this reflective circle, okay? And try not to get distracted by the other one. If it goes behind the card, just follow it as best as you can. Try to imagine where it would be. And just focus on it once you can see it again. Good. Very well done. Okay, I'm going to go a little bit quicker now. Now that your eyes are slightly more warmed up, keep focusing on your reflective dot. Good. How do you feel after that initial test? Okay, good. So the next thing that I want us to get used to is this eye mask. I'm not going to be shining any light through this eye mask for now, but I just want you to get used to the way that the gel balls inside it refract the light, okay? So, to build up, we will start with just three seconds of you wearing this, and then five, and then ten, okay? Are you ready for me to begin? Okay. I will place this over your eyes, and we will hold it for three, two, one. Good. Now you can blink a few 
few times. Good. If you could look at my finger up close and look at the wall behind me far away. Good. Just give your eyes a rest. Okay. So do you see what I mean about the way the mask refracts the light? Okay, great. So now are you ready to try five seconds? Great. Are you ready? Let's go. Five, four, three, two, and one. Very well done. You can blink, blink, blink. Good. Look at the wall behind me, looking at my finger, and I'm going to bring my finger all the way in. Good. Okay. Do you feel ready to try 10 seconds? Well done. Okay. Here it comes. I'm just placing the eye mask. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, and one. Very well done. You can blink and close your eyes for a second to give them a proper rest. Open your eyes, blink. Good. Try looking at the wall behind me. Look at my finger. I'm going to bring it all the way in and let's go all the way out. And can you look at the wall behind me over there? Blink, blink, blink. Okay. How are you feeling? Great. Let's continue. Now I'm going to start introducing some lights. Like I said, these lights are fairly dim. And for now, I just want you to be aware of them in your peripheral vision. I don't want you to look directly at them, okay? So if you could look at my finger over here, I'm going to begin to bring the light into your peripheral vision. Good. Keep looking at my finger. Very, very good. I'm just going to start slowly. Just bring the light in for a few seconds. And good. Okay, keep blinking, keep breathing. Good. Try to relax. Very well done. And let's try the other side. So if you can look at my finger up here, I'm going to bring the light in. Good. For a few seconds. Well done. Looking at my finger here. The light's coming in. Keep looking at my finger. Good. And once again, the light's coming in. Good job. Okay. Blink, blink, blink. You can close your eyes for a second. Okay. Do you feel ready to continue? Great. You could look straight ahead at my nose. I'm going to keep bringing it in your peripheral vision. I'm not asking you to look directly at the light yet, okay? So looking at my nose, it's still going to be in your peripheral, but it will be slightly closer to your point of focus. So you might notice it more. Good, you're doing so well. And I'm going to bring it in the other side. Good. Okay, great. That's very, very good. Well done. Okay. Let's leave that there for now. And let's move on to the next test. So... For this test, I'm going to be using this light, which is very powerful, and that's why I will not be shining it towards you at all. I'm going to be shining it on my hand, okay? So I'm going to begin with it very close to my palm. Okay, so it's going to look like this. Now, as I move the light, the circle of light will get bigger. 
so please observe good and let's stop there for a second how does that feel for you okay are you ready to try again good so just observing the palm of my hand where the torch touches my skin and just observing the circle of light that is created okay good let's have a little rest there i don't want to push us too fast too quickly so even if it feels like you're okay to continue it's always better to rest for a few seconds it can make such a difference so let's just blink breathe relax okay so i'm going to make the circles even bigger now and come further away from the palm of my hand so that the whole of my hand will be lit up by the torch once again i'll start close and i'll just make these circles Okay, just observe the circles on the palm of my hand and I'm going to start making it bigger. Okay, good. Now I'm going to shine up towards my fingers. Good. Just observe. And my thumb. Good. Okay. Now I'm going to trace each of my fingers. I'll begin with my thumb. Can you just watch the light as it traces each of my fingers? My index finger, my middle finger, my ring finger, and my pinky finger. Good. Okay. Very well done. How does that feel? Okay. Let's blink, blink, blink. Can you look at my finger close to you? And can you look at something far away behind me? Okay. Very well done. Let's continue a little bit more. So, I'm going to start with the light further away. So you can see your whole hand is lit up, lit up and I'm going to zoom in to my pinky and down coming away zoom in to my ring finger and bring it down good zoom in down and bring it away so zoom in to my index bring it down come away and zoom into my um, bring it down. Good. Can you watch the circle that I'm tracing on the palm? Good. And I'm going to light up each of my fingers. Good. Once again, circle around my palm and light of my fingers. One more time, creating a circle on the palm of my hand and lighting each of my fingers. Good. Okay. Very well done. That was excellent. Now we'll just have a little bit of a rest for your eyes. Can you tell me which finger is closer to you? On your left or on your right? Good. And now, on your left or on your right? Good. Now, on your left or on your right? Good. Okay. Let's take a few deep breaths. Great. You're doing so well. Now, the next test. I have some pieces of paper. I am going to write a letter or make a shape using the light behind the paper. So I want you to follow the 
outline of the shape or the letter with your eyes and tell me what you think it is, okay? So, let's begin. Okay, what was that? Good, it was a square. Are you ready again? What was that? Good, it was a circle or the letter O. And watching again. A bit more challenging. What was that? Good, it was the letter E. Okay, how are you feeling following these letters? Good. We'll try with a different colour. Same test. What was that? It was a heart. Good. What was that? It was the letter B. The letter B. Good. And what is this? It was a rectangle. Good. Okay. And we will try with the yellow. The yellow. So the light may appear brighter behind the yellow because it's a lighter colour. Do you feel ready to continue? Okay. So, what is this? It was the letter H. What is this? It was meant to be a star. Good. It was a slightly wonky star. What is this? It was the letter R. Very well done. Okay. Now, I'm going back to our light up tubes, our light up pop tubes, and we will do a few tests using two of the lights now, okay? So this will be double the amount of light. I feel that you are flying through the other tests, so I don't think this will be a problem, but if it is too much for you, just let me know, okay? And we'll take a break, or we can completely stop the tests. Good. So, looking straight ahead at my nose, I would like you to tell me if you see pink or yellow. Good. Once again, looking straight ahead at my nose, pink or yellow. Good. Pink or yellow? Good. Good. We're going to go a little bit quicker now. Good. You're doing a great job. Yep. Very well done. Good. Okay. Good. Good. Now, which one is closer to you? Pink or yellow? So one of the lights is going to be fairly close to your eyes, it may be fairly bright. Let me know if you'd like to stop. Which is closer to you, pink or yellow? Good. Pink or yellow, which is closer? Good. Which is closer? They're about the same. Pink or yellow? Good. Pink or yellow? Good. Pink or yellow? Good. Pink or yellow? Good. Okay. Now, I think you are ready to look directly at the light. So we will begin with this pink light. And I would like you to look, if you can, somewhere along, if you would like to look in the middle, one of the edges is completely up to you, and we will do just 
just a few eye movements just to see how that feels for you. Okay, good. Blink a few times, take a few breaths, relax your body, relax your head, your neck, your shoulders, try not to keep any tension up here. Good. Can you look at something far away? Look at something close, like my finger? Good. How does that feel? Wonderful. Let's continue with the pink. Just follow it across your field of vision. Keep following it. Good. Okay. Now. I'm going to bring in the yellow as well. I would like you to keep following the pink. And just ignore yellow for now. Good. Keep following the pink and ignore the yellow. Okay, I'm going to bring them slightly closer to you. Good job, you're doing so well. Keep breathing. Okay, now I'm going to ask you to switch your focus and focus on the yellow instead. Can you just follow the yellow light? Good. Okay. Very well done. Okay, we will stop there, let you have a little rest, don't forget to blink, breathe, relax, good. Now, the next test that we're going to do, it involves the bright light once again, this time the light will be shone through this rubber, this latex glove. Okay, so the light will be refracted slightly, it'll be made dimmer, and once again it won't be shone directly in your eyes, okay? So, are you ready to continue? Good. So I'm going to place this light inside the glove, and I'm going to light it now. As you can see, it creates this lit up thumb. Okay, let's move on to the next finger. Here we go. I'd just like you to focus on this lit up finger. The next finger. is actually broken at the end. I don't know if you can tell. But for this purpose it works just fine. Okay, we've just got two more. Almost there. You're doing so well. Is the smallest one. Good. 
Good. Good. Okay, that is the end of that one. How do you feel? How do your eyes feel? Okay, great. Let's continue then. So now we're going to go back to the gel eye mask that I introduced at the beginning of this session. And this time I am going to bring in some of these lights into your field of vision through the mask. And I will be coming quite close with them. The light will be refracted through the eye mask so it shouldn't be too bright or intense. Um, of course, if it is, please let me know. So what I'd like you to do is tell me what color you can see, okay? Let me just prepare my tools and then we will begin. You can just blink, rest and relax. Okay, are you ready? So I will place this over your eyes. I'm going to bring in a colour. Can you tell what coloured light I am showing you? Okay, I'm going to remove the light and remove the mask. Good. It was orange. I'm going to bring it in now. It was orange. Let's try again. I'm going to place this over your eyes and bring in another colour. Can you tell what colour this is? What colour do you think this is? Okay. It was in fact green this green tube. Okay, once again I'm covering your eyes. What colour can you see now? What colour is this? Okay, good. It is in fact red and this is the final one. What Color can you see now? Okay, good. That one was blue. Very well done. Now I want you to tell me when the light enters and leaves your field of vision, okay? Through the eye mask. So tell me when you see the blue light. Okay, and please tell me when it leaves. Okay, very good. We'll do the same with the orange. Tell me when the orange enters your field of vision. Okay, and tell me when it leaves. Okay, very good. One more time with the red. Tell me when it enters. Okay, good. And please tell me when it leaves. Okay. Finally, we have the green. Please tell me when it enters. Okay. And tell me when it leaves. Okay. Good. Very, very well done. You have done such an amazing job throughout today's session. Thank you so much for coming in to our facility. I think we will leave it there for today and I will let you know about future sessions. 
Okay, I think you've done so well and I'm feeling very confident for the future. Okay, so when you go home, I would highly recommend that you really take it easy, really go gentle with yourself, um, nothing too strenuous, um, and just get lots of rest tonight. Okay, it's very important that you get lots and lots of sleep after this. Okay, great. So, thank you so much, and I will see you soon.